Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, coming on stage next, the young man took a trip from Ghana and is blazing Nigeria right now. When I say life is easy, you say so that life is easy. So give it up for Mr. Easy. Go do you, Bassa Bassa, baby. Trust it. I see you, they give your heart to him. He will never let you go. He will never do you wrong, no. Baby, trust everybody. Let's go sing it. I go do your body like skin tight. I go do it by your sound. Then times when I know that you see car. You do it. See. So make a day your body like skin tight. You did by my side. Oh, DJ, drop it, drop it, drop it, drop it, drop it. Is that good? Is your body easy? That's right. Yeah. My name is Mohammed Indimi, father of engineer Mustafa Indimi. And uh, Mustafa he is a great young man, very well educated. He is a great young man. And I see something in Mustafa for a long time since he was young. Always he wants to look, he's a gentleman. And now he proved to me. He's a gentleman and a good young man. And uh, for me to see him through his life and now get married, and this is a wonderful achievement. I and my associates and the whole family, we are happy for him. Marriage is a life commitment. And my advice to him, Number one is to be patient. Without patient, you cannot achieve anything. Good evening. My name is Alicia Eccles, and I'm so honored to be here in Midagree, home of peace. I have heard countless stories about this beautiful city and culture from Fatima through recounts of her childhood. Her stories are always so passionate and vivid that I felt at home the few days spent here with family, friends, and her.
Uh, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Um, my name is Hussein Iwada. I'm one of Mustafa's very good friends. And um, it's clear from the samba dance steps on display at the Wushe Wushe on Friday that you guys thoroughly have enjoyed yourself during the course of this wedding. And for this, we give glory to the Almighty God. When I was notified that I will be called upon to say a few words, which I hope will be kind words about Mustafa, you know, rather than putting together a very predictive, bland and prescriptive speech, I said, look, the best thing to do is just play the role of a listener and just hear what the attendees to this event had to say about Mustafa. You know, I, I hear things like, Mustafa is an exceptional human being. I also heard someone say things like, Mustafa is a cool, calm, and collected fellow. The most common strap line, I think, which is Mustafa's signature strap line, is the fact that everyone attests to the fact that Mustafa is very humble. My name is Mrs. Fatima Mohammed Indimi. I'm Mustafa's mother. Mustafa is my fifth child. And Mustafa is a good, very, very good child. And he's always happy, charming, he's caring. He's very generous. I'm very glad when Mustafa decided to approach Fatima to be his future wife. I'm very happy Fatima grew up together with all my children and her siblings together. We are very close. We are like family friends. And I know Fatima is a good girl also. She's very patient. And I'm very happy. Yeah, I wouldn't have made any better choice. His choice is good. And I wish them all the best, long life and prosperity. May I love you with them all the time. We share one thing in common, the South of France. The South of France was the beginning of many significant events. It's where I met Fatima, where Mustafa knew he wanted to marry Fatima, and where he later asked her to be by his side forever. Fatima and I met at University of Monaco. We quickly became inseparable and later best friends. There is a point in our lives where we spent so much time around each other that she started speaking like an American and I as a Nigerian. It did not take long for me to realize Fatima was a genius. Perhaps she is not a genius in the way that you all are thinking. No, Fatima cannot multiply seven digit multiples inside of her head. But in fact, she is a creative genius. Fatima's creativity is so effortless and flawless that it is literally on a scale of genius. I'm sure that her ability to devise innovative solutions while problem solving is why she later matriculated and graduated from the top university in the world, Harvard University. Fatima is a lady of many talents and she is very knowledgeable about everything.
now, the challenge for you, Malama Fatima, is this. You've heard all I've said about Mustafa, right? If in a few months' time, the story changes, we know where to lay the blame at. <laughs> okay? But anyway, on a much more cordial and reconciliatory tone, we've heard very positive things about you. Everybody who says a thing about you starts with the fact that you are intelligent and you, you went to Harvard. And I say to them, I'm not interested in that. Being intelligent and going to Harvard does not make a marriage. But they take it a, a notch further by saying that you are a girl of admirable character and a very good reputation. So what this clearly means is that in this fine gentleman and this lovely lady, you have a match founded upon love, a match made in heaven, you know, and a match worthy of envy. The kindest woman I know. Oh. oh. The most beautiful woman there is. Just to cut Kiku. <laughs> Sorry, continue. The most considerate person there ever was. My dear wife. Shall we please walk over there and walk the cake? Aye! Oh! My brother, my brother, just just keep kneeling down, I'm coming. Wait, excuse me, where about you both wife? Or you both come? We need that today. Let me just do this. Have you snapped the picture? Snap, snap. Have you snapped it? Uh, we're going to frame this picture, right? You keep one in the bedroom, one in the toilet, one in the kitchen, one in the parlor. Any day you shout, you show him the picture. <laughs> All right, so um, give the microphone now. I want to have a response. To... Before we go. Oh, before we go. Okay, sorry. To cut the cake. Okay. Yeah. I want you to know that I will always love you. Hi. Oh, where my wife now? Come, Oyibo. Wait, you they block me. I'm saying the same thing to you. I will always cherish you. I will always cherish you. And I will forever worship you. Ah! Oh, Mustafa Waina! Oh! Ah! Even your sisters now, they are wishing they are the bride. Oh, God of mercy. Oh, can you clap for this gentleman, ladies and gentlemen? Ah! Oh! Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. I feel like jumping in the well. Ah, no, this man, this man is. No, 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 no. Ladies and gentlemen, the couple's first dance. When your legs don't work like they used to before, it's a romantic dance. And I can't sweep you off of your feet If you are old, you will not understand it Will your mouth still remember the taste of my love? Will your eyes still smile from your cheeks? Ah. Darling, I will be loving you Till we're 70 Baby, my could still fall as hard at 23 And I'm thinking about how people fall in love in mysterious ways Maybe just the touch of a hand Well me I fall in love with you every single day And I just want Tell you I am So honey now Take me into your loving arms Kiss me under the light of a thousand stars There are so many stories that I could tell about Fatima However, I will conclude with this one Fatima is one of the best cooks to ever live. I will never forget when Fatima cooked me indomie and boiled egg. I immediately called my Nigerian friend back in Miami and told her how I regretted never rating her indomie. When I asked Fatima about her engagement, she told me that Mustafa told her 
that he knew he wanted to marry her because she had made him the quickest bowl of Indomie. After I heard that story, I thought to myself, man, this Indomie is something serious. Not only is it tasteful, but it captures you a husband as well. All jokes aside, Mustafa was already aware of Fatima's abundance of amazing characteristics. Her time efficiency is what captured his heart and made him fall heads over heels. Beyond her magical endomie, Fatima is equivalent to a five-star chef. I learned a year ago that I was maybe the only person in the world who had ever experienced her cooking. Mustafa. Now that you have married my best friend, my sister, you are now more like a brother. Fatima has spoken so highly of you that I know you will treat her well. You will be a great husband to her and a great father to her unborn kids. You will inspire Fatima to be greater through your own aspirations of greatness. I'm sure that there's consistency across this room that you are extremely intelligent and hardworking and that a man such as yourself will always be able to provide for your family. Through observations these, fa these past few, year few days, it is crystal clear to everyone in this room that the love in your eyes, the care in your heart, and the affection of your touch for Fatima is true. You, are, you two are equally deserving of each other, and it is so beautiful to see you two together now forever. And I would like to say to Fatima that I love you so much, more than words can describe. I know you will be a respectful, loving wife to Mustafa, and I'm honored that you thought so highly of me to deliver this speech on your behalf. Congratulations and many blessings to you, Ian. Oh, darling, place your head on my beating heart. Yeah, yeah. Within this hour, when I do so you did leak lollipop. Yeah, now nah you did from Robocop, but not to the reality must come out. Oh, yeah, ask them who don't no know me, yo, Luba. Who want the flow, so with me, Mr. Luba, Luba. I'm a game in the back seat, in New Holland. One fellow tap it, what they do want to see all that. Who don't follow me, Ramadan? Yeah, 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 yeah